Cross, multiply, and divide. So two times two is gonna be four. And then nine X times three X is gonna be 27 X. Okay, and then we're gonna solve for X. So we're gonna say we need to divide. Okay, so we get X equals, and what is four over 27? Six point. 6.75, okay, you can do it to two decimal places. You don't need to round. Um, okay, and that's it. Some of them are gonna be a little bit more complex with multivariables, but nothing like crazy, okay? So on this one, we got three times X. It's gonna be three X. Six times four is gonna be 24. Okay, and then we're gonna divide by three. What are you gonna get for your X? Eight. Eight, okay, some of these you're gonna get a decimal, some of them you're gonna get um, a whole number. Okay, I do not want your answer as a fraction, okay? So on your calculator, push that S to D button if you need to convert it from a decimal to a fraction. Okay, the ones that are like this, um, where they have something with it, um, you, you need to use that parentheses and distribute. So you're gonna say two times, um, r minus four, so it really looks like this, two times r minus four, you need to make sure that you times that two by each piece, okay? And you really don't have to write it all out, okay? Because if you want to look at it, two times r is gonna be what? Two r, and then you say two times negative four, negative eight, negative eight okay? Which is what you would get without writing out the parentheses, okay? So um, either one would be fine, and then eight times eight is gonna be 64. Okay, but this step, so you're gonna kind of have to, to write out and work out. How do you, what do you move first? You subtract or add eight. Add eight. Okay, so you're gonna get two R equals? 72. 72. And then divide by two. And what are you gonna get? 36. Hey. Yep. Yes, absolutely. Thanks. Okay, uh, 10 times nine is gonna be 90. Okay, and then for the other side, we got four times M, four M, four times one, four. Okay, what needs to move first? Subtract four. Subtract four. So you're gonna get what? 86, 86 equals four M. And then what? Divide by four. four. So what is 86 divided by four? 21.5. 21.5? Okay, nine. It does not matter if you do the four times six first or the nine times R1 first, okay? It doesn't make any difference either way. Okay, so nine times R is gonna be nine R, and then nine times one is nine, equals 24. It's not open. Okay, so we're gonna say minus nine, minus nine. Okay, what's 24 minus nine? 15. 15. So then you're gonna get 15 divided by nine. What are you gonna get? 1.6. 1. 1.6. 1. And now you good? What's the matter, are you tired? You not talking to me now? Oh. <coughs> Okay, nine times four, you're gonna get 36 <coughs> equals five X plus 20.
Okay, minus 20 from both sides. And you're going to get what? 32, or no, 16. 16 equals 5x. Okay, so 16 divided by 5, what are you going to get? Huh? 3.2. Okay, last one. 10 times P is going to be 10P. 10 times negative 10. Negative 100. Equals 27. Okay, so we say plus 100. We get 10p equals 127. And then divide by 10. And what are you going to get? 12.7. Okay, you guys got seven of them to do on this side, okay? All the uh, evens. Um, make sure that you bring your iPads tomorrow. The sub's not going to be able to hook up the TV. I can almost guarantee it, but...